welcome back to the channel. Um, we're going to continue with this painting. I'm doing these in short seg segments so that um, you're not having to watch for a long period. Normally, I can because I can be up here painting for hours if my back allows me to, and so on and so forth. <clears throat> so we're going to get started on this this time and the colors I am going to put on this time is gray just plain gray um, some burnt umber amber umber Umber, whichever way you want to pronounce it. Now, if we get, if this goes pretty good, we may add some other colors. But this is what I picked out for now. And then we're going to do a cold gray. If I can get it off. Oh, wow. Well, we're going to be able to get it out. Looks like this. Oh, there it goes. <clears throat> We've got our jar of water ready. Um, we'll do some, t of course, we're going to put some titanium white on here just in case. And then I got two other colors that are picked out, and that'll really depend on um, how far we get. So I'm going to leave those off for now because I don't want to put them on and then waste the paint. But I have them picked out, and hopefully I'll remember where I put them. Okay, so now I am going over to my brushes over here. I'm going to try it this way. I might have wanted to do a little. And this is really just doing a little outline for me right now. That's why I chose lighter color there. Maybe it'll look, make it look like there's... Okay, so now we're going to go back with that cold gray. And sort of blend in. Of course. My phone rings because I'm on the video, you know? <laughs> and really, it's, it's just more of a layering effect that I'm doing with colors. Put a little more gray over here. We're actually, to me, we are now starting to work on the actual painting because we're already done with the background. So this is the background to the, the whole painting. So we're going to put some happy little mountain healy type things. In here, <clears throat> I guess in a way, I'm sort of, I, I do kind of 
in some sense I do kind of paint like Bob Ross though he actually though you didn't really see it he did plan his out more I'm sort of a go with the flow ish type painter um, I, I don't like going through photos or anything like that. I, I will do a still life. I do know how to do a still life. Um, but really, I, I like to be able to paint just what, at that moment in time when I'm painting, uh, makes me sort of happy or and sometimes even if it makes me sort of sad because that means there's probably something out there or in my life that maybe I need to work through you know um, and now I'm going to use a little bit the other gray start taking this down here. And there is a reason I'm sort of doing this a little more muted. Um, then bringing it really, like, really up front to you. And that is because towards the end, we're going to put a spin on this painting. And you're going to have to wait see that little spin and so I'm mixing a little bit of these colors as I'm working with them on the on the painting themselves to get the effect that I'm looking for and if I mess up you guys will all know so I have not practiced doing this painting Just for that that reason, I, I want to. I um, want to be sort of transparent in that. You just really sort of kind of work it until you get it to where you want it. And I'm not really liking this little bit here. So we're going to work that just a little more. There we go. That's a little better. So what I was saying about Bob Ross, I am like him in, in that um, I, I don't work off of like photos and stuff. Um, at least as far as we know, he never did. And 
I'm going to mix a little bit of my uh, titanium white with some of that cold gray. See if I can do this right without really messing this up. It was like I said. <laughs> it's not working like I want it to. Let's see, do we have another option here? We are going to try this one. Oh, someone doing this for me. <coughs> okay. So we're going to go back in here some. switch over this way so I can work a little bit of a different angle. And now this is where I want to put a little more color into that. Oh well, helps to take the tab off. So I mean got some deep green. And some maples, or maples yellow. Okay. See as we got these two. We're going to... Oh, 
Now I know it doesn't look like much right now, and I promise it will get there. So I just dip this in a little bit of water. Now we're going to be doing more work to this, so this is is far from the finished piece. But we're getting there. It's a good start, I think. So... <coughs> This is where I'm going to stop because really, um, it is quite wet yet, and I, I don't want it to muddle too much, but as we go, we you'll see more of what we're getting into there, and the surprise at the end. Alright, we'll work on the mountains. You guys... If you like what you're seeing, if you're learning something, please like, subscribe, share, comment, any of those things that you would like to do. And I want to know that I appreciate you guys coming and checking out my channel and watching my videos and your wonderful comments. Thank you. <laughs>